Hey everyone, today we've got something a little different. We've got some very big trucks. These are both what I would call cab over trucks. They're called cab overs because the cab sits on top of the engine. These are really neat. Um, the brand is called Road Kings and I think it's basically a division of KK scale and I can tell that because of the packaging and everything. It's all KK scale. This first one's an Iveco, a Turbo Star in a really kind of neat late 80s, early 90s livery. Pretty detailed. This is non, well, semi-opening die cast because the doors do open. But I like the, you know, the simulated airlines, spare tire, if I can show it underneath without breaking it. There's your spare tire. Pretty neat piece. It's retail for about 159, 169. And I got it cheap for a reason during the American Excellent Sell Down this uh, steering linkage was split in two and this will bring me to a quick little repair tip no matter how I glued this the weight of the wheels pulled it apart so my technique for fixing it which I fixed it yesterday it's been you know sitting around with wheels askew for almost a year now it took literally a minute I took my handy dandy uh, Tamiya mini drill that's the bit I used. I drilled a small hole in the center of each side. Uh, I drilled a little over a quarter inch onto each side and then I took this little bit of extra metal rod and I cut it to about mm, half an inch, inserted into each side and a little bit of glue and it is, it's holding. So, I mean, I, I got this for $50 because of that, that issue. It took me one minute to repair. So the lesson is it's kind of worth having some of these model specific tools like that to me a uh, mini drill it really proves itself handy now again the doors do open on this I mean the detail is not amazing uh, KK scale and road kinks they're kind of a value price brand I mean th this is a big boy so it's retail of $159 you know it's it's not absurd and obviously at $50 I'm, that price I'm not mad at it really neat piece packaging like I said it, it screams KK scale if you owned a KK scale the box is black if I can give myself a little bit more room here because it is a big box box is black there's always a color picture of it and there's always a mention of how many pieces this is one of 700 so yeah I'm I'm not I haven't done the research but I'm confident it's basically KK scale so same brand again we have a Scania Another cab over in Scania is related to Saab. And so, you know, I am I am a bit of a Saab guy, so I had to have this. Again, this is pretty cool. Late 80s or early to mid 90s design. The color scheme is awesome. The little mud flaps, really neat. Something people don't mention, <laughs> my only issue with this brand is it stinks. The chemical smell of rubbers and plastics and paint I guess is it's overwhelming it it's stinking up the entire room it's mainly this one in my hand I guess because it's so factory fresh it really stinks so again we've got cool airlines we have if I can open it an opening door you'll have to take my word for it the door opens let me see if I can get it two hands Yes, two hands did it. So yeah, again, not the most detailed. It's not amazing. But again, for $159 retail, this was on sale at, uh, I think, Model Car World for about $90 US dollars. I, I don't know. I think that's kind of a steal for metal, die-cast metal, this big, this detailed. Again, you have your simulated spare tire. I just think these are neat package again is nearly identical but I'll show you anyway so there's your picture box this one is one of 400 pieces so these are pretty neat I don't know if anyone's gonna care about this review I don't know anyone who's really interested in big heavy trucks like this but I don't know I think they're pretty neat and they're pretty popular the Road Kings is doing quite a few of these 
There's Volvo trucks, there's uh, Mercedes trucks, there's a little bit of everything out there. So if this does tickle your fancy, give Road Kings a look. So that's it for this week. Everyone have a good one. Please like and subscribe.